Hey, welcome to the Wilbur Chronicles. I want to share with you this nugget of wisdom. It comes from Proverbs 15.1. A gentle answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. You've probably experienced that. Have you ever had someone like come at you, they're angry, like guns blazing, but instead of responding with anger, you responded with maybe gentleness or love, and you suddenly saw the anger dissolve or at least decrease? That's what the proverb says. A gentle answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Because if you respond with anger to anger, what happens? Man, it just gets crazy. Dude, this is my other dog. Her name is Sophie. Now, she looks all cute and cuddly right now, but she is a terror. I mean, she commands the house. Some of you have met Wilbur already, my 105 pound golden. Wilbur is almost controlled by her. But not really, because he's so much bigger than her. So when she comes snapping at him, she's like, rawr, 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 rawr. Wilbur just kind of looks down, and then she backs away. He doesn't enter into the dogfight. He actually responds to anger with gentleness. Again, it's Proverbs 15.1. A gentle answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. This week, you and I have the opportunity to bring peace to our home or peace to where we work or maybe it's peace in a relationship with a friend or someone who's angry at you because when you respond with kindness that will decrease the anger but here's the problem responding with kindness it doesn't come naturally i mean goldens their temperament is to be calm and maybe even content but us you and me when someone's angry, we want to get really angry back at them. So how do we live out this proverb? We need to let the peace of Christ rule in our hearts. And when that peace is in our heart, out of our heart, comes peace, kindness, love. So really the first response is to look to God, that God would give us His peace, give us His love. And then we can respond to the other, even when they're really angry, with kindness. And what happens when a gentle answer turns away wrath? It brings peace to your home or peace to your relationship or maybe simply just peace in your heart because you don't enter into the dogfight. The love of God is profound, but it's not just for us to hold on to, it's for us to give away. Okay, so one more time, Proverbs 15:1. A gentle answer turns away wrath but a harsh word stirs up anger. How do we do it? We receive God's love, and then we give that love away. Thanks for coming to the Wilbur Chronicles.